Okay, day two of shower demolition. It's pretty scary. <clears throat> We're looking over into the closet, which is going to be the half bath in that bedroom. And uh, well, of course, as you remember, this is the alcove here. It was about a foot wider when there was a bathtub in there. Okay, <clears throat> all of that weight, the cement, the plaster, the tiles, the bricks, plus all of the uh, three foot by six foot cubed out junk in that closet, plus all the lath and plaster. <laughs> that joist there he cut off, well, it was basically rotten. And then whoever made this shower back in 1960 cut the joist right in half to play with that vent there uh, for the uh, shower to, when, after they took out the bathtub. Thankfully, there's a, a pier right here. They tried to shore up something there. You can kind of tell. There's a little uh, post there. <laughs> but what's scary is when I look in here, as you can see this joist right here, it's all rotten too. See? And then over in this corner here, let me turn this around. Right over here. <laughs> It just like plunked down on top of that. That's going, I don't know how they're going to do jack that up. So it explains why the bathrooms are kind of droopy over years of all that just squishing down like that. And look at, if you ever wondered in old houses, they didn't have that uh, quick set stuff. It's like about two and a half inches of cement here uh, underneath the tile. Two and a half inches of cement. But at least under here, there's not really water damage. But you see, this is why this cracks like this. It's, it's this corner, the weight is going down right here. There's a, another crack there. But, uh, and then it slowly, you can see. But it's, it's amazing to think of all that weight that's been removed. It seems like this house should just pop back into shape and should be squared out again after taking that all down. But anyway, he's going to be back tomorrow and uh, and then and, and start framing it up and shoring it up and getting the shower all cubed up again. This little thing, if you're ever wondering what that is, that little box here, that's where the uh, in-the-wall ceramic soap holder was when this was a bathtub. <laughs> yeah. So, there we go. Day two of demolition and uh, tomorrow begins the framing routine. So we're inching our way closer and just glad we're getting it taken care of. All right, next checkup or uh, next uh, check-in will be tomorrow.